back when I was studying mechanical engineering at the university, I remember exploring concepts such as the efficient use of energy and resources, reducing waste disposal and minimizing environmental damage. With sustainability as a prominent part of my education, I knew early on that my career should be focused on eco-friendly efforts. And this is exactly what I found in Gianni Mori Engineering. The business of custom designing and manufacturing tailored recycling plants was a perfect fit for my education and training as an engineer. GME's commitment to global sustainability, along with its mission to radically reduce the usage of raw materials was in complete alignment with my personal aspirations. In just 10 short years, GME has become one of the industry's major players, with over 30 plants designed and built on three different continents. GME plants recycle almost 1 million tonnes of waste every year and yield 90% recovery of scrap components, focusing on used lead-acid batteries and aluminium scrap. With over 30 years of combined experience, GME's task is to design and manufacture a recycling plant tailored to each client's individual needs and specifications. The end result being a facility that is both durable and sustainable and guarantees perfect output quality. This is exactly what Sahel Industries Holding Group was looking for when they approached GME with their request. Perfect separation of ULAB components using the new Gravity Breaker. GME Gravity Breaker is a new and innovative process. We use the inertial mass and the gravity force to separate the five key elements which compose the lead used battery. Those elements are grids, poles, lead paste, polyethylene for separators and polypropylene for the case of battery. Thanks to this uh, process, we can reduce the waste formation, the time and the cost. However, there is uh, a unique component in the GME plant that they achieved an impressive result, such as our new hammer mill with the new T-shaped hammer that can guarantee the perfect hammering of the ULAB scraps. They also achieved the twice life long as the previous one. The other feature, very important feature, is uh, about the vibrating hydro screen. That's item composed by the screen washed by high pressure jet that guarantee the separation of the lead paste that will be collected in a tank from the under screen materials such as plastic separators and others. This high pressure guarantees the perfect washing system in the way to simplify the next steps. Speaking about the water is very important element for GME. That's why we introduce neutralized system in our plant in the way to make the water in a closed loop and to remove the acid inside, maintaining the pH about the 4.5 in the way to reducing the cost of maintenance and improving the lifetime of the plants. Our design of the compact water rising system, we can ethically separate the absorbed glass mat and the separators from the metallic part, which follow another process where we can separate definitively the heaviest part from the finest part. All of these features combined together make a very new and innovative process. That's why you can find that one in our plants. Some clients, such as here, Swahil Group, believe us and with a very compact design plan with high quality results, we can reach the 90% or higher of recovery ULAB scrap with minimal waste formation. Application of this system is designed to reduce the time to smelt as well as fuel oxygen consumption and maintenance costs. This means less air pollution compared to a standard process and minimal waste formation and lead waste presence. 
As part of the entire plant commissioning, step two and step three will be the installation of furnaces and kettles that will facilitate smelting and refining. This new plant will mark a major milestone for Sahail Group when it's completed, as it will be the first smelting facility for ULAB recycling in the state of Qatar. In the end, you can count on a gratifying experience with an innovative and successful recycling plant at your feet, guaranteed. After all, GME's success is entirely dependent on the success of its clients.